And I had a chance to meet Blaine three years ago when my son and Blaine were tennis uh, teammates in Holt High School. And this is our future. And to see Blaine come as far as he has in, in the last three years and to be able to stand up here before you this morning and articulate the value he got and has seen out of this program and continuing his education at Olivet and graduating after only three years. So congratulations, Blaine. So this is, this is the future and this is why we're here today. We had an opportunity in the Lansing Regional Chamber that we launched Ensuring Greater Lansing's Future. And it was an awareness program and campaign designed to bring a little bit greater awareness to this sector, to the insurance sector and the importance to our region. And so I'm so pleased to be standing here today to see that progress continuing on and the fact that we're celebrating this public-private partnership with the partners that we've mentioned here today with Ingham Intermediate School District, the Lansing School District, the Insurance Institute of Michigan, and Accident Fund Insurance Company of America, all members of our organization and all doing great things to continue to grow this sector here in our region and especially addressing that issue of education and talent. You, you've heard the, the pending job shortage, the retirement and whatnot, and we certainly know that for this sector to continue to grow in our region, it's going to start with talent, and that's what we have to have, and this is what this program is, is about. We're the insurance capital of Michigan. We firmly believe that. We firmly believe that we're even taking that farther and really kind of becoming the insurance capital of the upper Midwest. Over $500 million in economic investment in the last five to six years, including this magnificent building we're standing in this morning. Uh, the types of jobs, close to 8,000 direct jobs in our sector. The type of jobs, I will tell you, that every region in this country are trying to attract and grow. And we need to do what we can to keep our young talent and young people here. And it's a sector that's going to continue by all projections and all accounts, some of the fastest job growth and demand of any other sector.